What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It is I, Zanoxus, bringing you some more Seven Deadly Sins Grand Cross. I do not know why I said it that way. Anyway, so today I wanted to start a journey with you guys. I've decided that now is the time to start a lot of journeys, um, doing things on my personal side with uh, that sort of thing. Anyway, not the point. However, I would like to get Challenger someday in uh, in Elite PvP. So, I figured, uh, what better the day than today? So, actually, I'm going to use the milk and strawberry. So, this is the team I'm running. The uh, gear isn't exactly perfect on... All of them, but I'm working on it. Um, like, I, I wish I had higher percentages on some of these, but uh, anvils are just too hard to come by. Um, but, like, I got a full pier set. I need to get an SSR pier set going on Hauser. And, you know, it, it's been working relatively well. Um, I got into Plat last season by the skin of my teeth right after I started this. I was running what I run on normal, uh, which is Eskinor, Gother, King, uh, and Merlin. Uh, anyway, moving on. We're going to get this done. I'm going to try to do five matches as quickly as possible and get them out. Uh, so I'm not going to record every every single match I do, but I'm going to, I'm going to try for at least, um, one set of matches a day, if not a couple of two or three matches a day, um, on camera. I mean, I, I play this game a lot, so, you know, doing every match, uh, every match, recorded would be nigh impossible. Um, this team is relatively simple. If you start out like this, you just kill King instantly. Boom. Um, if you get double Cruel Sun and an Axe Attack, or whatever it's called, um, Elegant Below, you also kill instantly. Um, this turn, depending on how he wants to play this Okay, so he's going to go for my king. Yeah. Uh, I was going to try and... Uh, petrify him. But that is no longer an option. So instead... I'm just going to let king... Die. Um, so... If I want to do this the right way, I should do this, then this, and then I'll petrify. King's final act will be to petrify. Um, and it'll get Hauser his ult. Now, Merlin can just remove it, but that is one more card that he's forced to play. I really should turn on sound. I'll do it before the next game. Oh ho yo Sakai, good morning world. And that's fine. King goes down. Um He did not force my ult, so that's good. I'm just gonna do this and then this and then Um I could do the Arthur attack, but no, I'm okay. I'm just going to secure. I'm just going to secure the kill here. Yeah, I and mean, I probably could have just used Arthur attack and been fine. But in this way, I might actually kill somebody else as well. Yeah, and Merlin's the only one left. This team is gross. It just is. Uh, Arthur doesn't serve any purpose besides his, uh, his skill, his, 
what is it called? Uh, his buff that he gives, which is all humans gain 15% HP, I believe. Um, it, it, it's useful. Uh, I've survived many attacks due to having a little extra buffer. Uh, game settings. Okay, so we'll turn this up a little bit. Weird. There we go. Um, and I place champion four in normal, so that's that's cool. Anyway, on to the next. Sorry. It took me a while to actually find a match, which is weird. I didn't think it would take very long. So let's see what happens this time. I'm hoping for pretty much the same start as last time. Uh, that would be best. Uh, the situation is slightly different, however. It is a double cruel sun. Uh, now I can either try to completely remove Arthur or Gother. I think I'm going to try to remove Arthur. No, I have to remove Gother. Now, the better call might have been to actually use um, a different card as my final, like maybe one of the Hauser cards. Uh, he is more than likely going to double uh, upgrade into Arthur. Oh, no, he's going to double upgrade himself. Hmm. Interesting. I didn't expect that, simply because... No, I'm not going to do that. It's better for me just to do this. Um... It's going to get downgraded anyway. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure I removed the Gother from the game. Now there is less likelihood that Arthur is going to get an upgrade. Oh, uh, that sucks. How's our ult's going to go off? And I'm going to lose these these upgrades. Uh, which is fine. I'll get another Petrify up regardless. So now i got to figure out who I'm targeting next. Hauser is the biggest threat I'm seeing. But if Arthur is able to buff... Um, it'll be a lot of trouble. So, I think I have to target Arthur next. Um, because I can't let him buff. Oh, actually, sorry. Oops. A lot of staticky sound coming through. I'm sorry, guys. I don't know what that's caused from. So, depends on what he wants to do this turn. Um, okay, he didn't kill anyone somehow. Uh, I think I have to remove Merlin. And I just go for whatever I can kill. Which is hopefully the Arthur. This should one-shot the Merlin. Yeah. But I'm not going to kill that Arthur. Yeah, that might have actually cost me the game. Hauser was more than right, likely the better target. Uh, because there's no way I'm surviving this. Sorry, I'm watching my battery life, guys. It's weird that he would do that first rather than clean up with it. 
just in case somebody survived this. Um, which there was no way anybody was going to, but... You know, just in case somebody survived that. That's fine. That's a loss. One win, one loss. I hate how much you lose for a loss in gold. I really do. Because um, that just put me back so far. Like that, it's absolutely ridiculous. Your first five games shouldn't fluctuate that much, you know. But that's just me. That's just me. It is super early in the morning, so I'm getting very tired. But, hey, we're going to try to make good decisions anyway. So, depending on what I get... Okay. Um, we're going to try to eliminate King. It's not going to work. He's going to live with very little health unless I get a crit. Which I did not. Yeah. I still can't decide which of the two Hauser cards I actually like better. Whether it's the crit chance one or the, uh, the pure straight one. I think I actually like the pure straight one a little bit more. I see that doing a little bit more damage. Uh, but this turn is actually pretty simple. I'm gonna, uh, uh, fucking Hauser card right off the bat. And then use Eskinor and, um, Eskinor's Elk and Blue. And then Fossilization. Uh, assuming he doesn't, like, straight up kill. Okay, so no Fossilization this turn. That's fine. Um, the plan still remains pretty much the same. With me doing this and this, and then cleaning up with this. Yeah. So here it doesn't really matter who it hits. Alright, cool. I'll take it. Um, Merlin, if he comes in, she comes in, is not going to really do a ton. She's going to roll back some ultimates, but I don't necessarily care about that. Now, the question is, do I go for the gold... I do. If he doesn't kill. Which he's about to kill. Yep. He just straight up tried to nuke my king. Which is fine. I did the same. <laughs> now, what's annoying... Is not being able to actually move because... Of, uh... Of that. Oh. But, that's fine. I'm going to get away with it because Eskinor is broken. So now he's going to hit me with um, with the Gother ult. And that's fine. Uh, it's going to do a little bit. Is it the one mixed with King? It is not. Right, because I killed King. So I could just make a uh, level 3 Hauser attack. Oh, he just surrenders. He just straight up surrenders. And that's fine. So we're going to keep on moving. Uh, I use combat class uh, food because we really want to go first. More than having extra stats, more than having uh, extra damage, we really want to go first. Now, on my own, I'm probably going to end up using uh, coin food for this and for normal because I, I really need uh, festival coins. So, I'm actually not very good at this game. Uh, I'm still still learning, even though I've been playing since day one of global. Um, so bear with me when I make mistakes. Uh, this is unfortunate because I hate, absolutely hate King Brum. I I would really like a crit here, Eskinor. Thank you. That's gonna kill. Almost didn't. I hate King Brum because it doesn't matter if you kill fucking King first and King Brum. It really doesn't. I wish it did, but it doesn't. See, it's really unfortunate here, 
because I'm either going to have to move the card or unpetrify somebody. Uh, it's not a problem if he kills King, however. If he kill, kills King right now, then it just removes my dilemma entirely. Yeah. Alright, well, just gave me a Hauser, a level 3. Uh, almost gave me Hauser ult. So, now I aim for... Now I aim for Kingram. I really want to go for Demon Melly, but I don't think that's the smartest call. Or, sorry, Helbrum. Did I keep calling him Kingram? <laughs> Oops. I, I really need to eliminate Helbrum simply because of how dangerous he is with having Petrify and removing Ultimate. Uh, if he removes the Ultimate with a level 1 or a level 2 card, I still get it because of uh, the fusion, the way the cards work out. So that's really good. Uh, and in the case that he level threes. Yep, cool. Okay. He didn't expect me to get the ultimate again. He's just gonna go for the petrify. That's fine. Um, however, what this tells me is I can do this. And this. And then, uh, this, I guess. It doesn't really matter at that point. Nice. So this actually should kill Eskinor. Uh, and it'll kill Demon Melee, too. That worked out incredibly well. If I hadn't gotten the house roll, uh, things would have turned out much worse for me. By the way, I'm sorry for all the static heat noise during the music. I'm not exactly sure what's going on there. Not sure at all. I don't know if it's just the, uh, the dongle that I have connected to my phone, connected to my headphones, or if it is my headset itself that's causing the static. Um, I haven't really noticed it more or less when I move my phone around. I just no mostly notice it when I'm in fight. So another King Room, uh, but slightly different because it has Gother. This is the more dangerous version of King Room, I would say. Uh, and I kind of need to play it slightly different. Um... In fact, I need to play it completely different. I'm going to get rid of that card and go for the Petrify. Uh, it is probably better for me if I would have just killed King right off the bat. But I feel stalling a turn to make sure I can get the kill on him is more valuable. Uh, it's going to be real dangerous if he gets Gother ult immediately, which it looks like he's going for. He's not. Okay. If he'd gotten a second Gother card at the turn one, he could fuse the two Gother cards and then um, get uh, ult immediately. So now I can just do this, this, and this. This will absolutely 100% get rid of King. I actually probably overkilled it slightly. Uh, I definitely overkilled it. I could have uh, double firebombed and then cleaved. But that's okay. I would rather secure the kill than uh, potentially die because I did not. So what is he going to do here? He's going to go for Gother Alt, And then he's probably going to petrify somebody. More than likely King. And he's going to level 2 petrify at least. He's going to level 3 and just annihilate fucking... And that's level 2 Petrify. So that'll last for one turn. Um, that's okay. I wasn't really doing a lot with King anyway. However, uh, it does suck that... I can't eliminate Gother. So I'm just going to do this and this. Get as much damage on the Gother as I can. 
Gother is my next biggest threat, uh, because he can completely remove the threat of Hauser. Just by using the level 2 of his, um, his AoE. So, this is going to hurt a lot. I'm going to lose Eskinor at least, if not King as well. This might not be a winnable fight. It might not kill King, actually. I'm seeing the damage from Gother. It might not kill King. It didn't kill King. Okay, I didn't have really any Eskinor cards anyway. Ah. He did end up killing King. That's unfortunate. Um, now I'm going to have to try to pull this off with... Arthur... It's okay. So I, I, I'm going to have his ult next. I'm going to try to eliminate Merlin for the simple reason of having one less character on the field. Uh, this will give them one less card to do things with as well. So I actually kind of want him to remove my ult. Uh, because that way I can move the Arthur card. Uh, he's going to level 3 it. Ow. That really fucking hurts, dude. So I can do this. And then I can do this. Uh, that gives me a little bit more health. Unfortunately, if he... He can do a lot here. That really hurts me. Um... How did I play this wrong here at the end? And I know I played this very wrong, but I'm trying to figure out how I played it wrong. I just need... I need him to survive one more turn. He's not going to. He's going to petrify. Yeah. Yeah. That's GG. Um, the only way I win this is by killing here. Uh, I have to kill here. I have to survive this ult. I have to survive this. If he... No, he wasn't going to do it. I was going to say, if he used um, the the drawback instead, the, the rollback on my ultimate, instead, I might not win this. Uh, this has to crit, and it has to kill. Boom. Get fucked, King Arum. King Brum, get fucked. Yeah, so the right call for him would have been to roll back Arthur's uh, ultimate and take the hit from uh, from Hauser. Because Hauser is infinitely weaker than uh, a 6-6 six, six ultimate from Arthur. Yeah, by the way, my Arthur is 6-6. Six, six. <laughs> so, he's, he's really strong. Anyway, so that's um, that's really good. That's that's a really good start to my road to champion. All right, you guys, you have a wonderful day, and peace out.